Hello and welcome to the newest and reinvented edition of the Cauliflower and Shaver Show. Yeah. Where we interview the lesser known celebrities and they like us. Usually. Usually. We know we have weird names, you know. Uh, we're quite goofy on an anticlimactic scale. I think you mean epic cauliflower, an epic scale. Anyway, we enjoy interviewing celebrities, but the thing you gotta understand about us is that we believe that cinema is real and there are no special effects whatsoever. No special effects at all, you got that right. We even had to go to anger management because we lost our tempers over that ridiculous concept. Oh, no. Special effects? Come on, it's real. There's no special video effects. Video does not lie. There's no, 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 video does not lie! No, video no does lie. lie! No! It is unprecedented! No! You didn't know it's happened before. Okay. It was real! It was real, man! It was real! I know it was. It's not real, man. I, I can't believe it. Get out of here! Just. Go, go. You know, we've interviewed celebrities like uh, Bruce Willis. He didn't even have any hair. Oh, well, no, he did have hair. Yeah. Gosh. So, how's it going, Bruce? It's been going fine. Cool. Are you married still? Yeah. How much did you pay? He's supposed to be bald. Bruce bald. Willis is always bald. Bald. Matrix Reloaded guys and the Olsen twins. Even though they lied to us. They're Things here! Over with. Oh. Have places to go! Things Dude! Things they don't see. look like the Olsen twins. No, no, no. Oh, why aren't you the Olsen twins? We are the Olsen twins. They just told me that you guys aren't the real Olsen twins. What? Oh, yes, we are! Oh. Oh. That one girl called me a girl. I know! That was a freaking insult! You look like a girl, but you know, we don't know why. That was an insult, sir. That was an insult! An insult, man. Ah, ah, ah. Exactly. Sorry, this <sighs> old school, but it still comes out, you know. And then there were the actresses who played Charlene <laughs> Angels. I may have pushed the envelope a little bit when I compared them to animals. I think you pushed the envelope a little too far that uh, time. But what a laugh! It's so good. It's to nice be to here. see you, ladies. How are you? I nice see you too. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> okay. Cameron Diaz. I kind of figured that you were kind of like a uh, koala. What? Because you're like koala. And Lucy Liu, I was thinking that you're more like the uh, badger. <laughs> <laughs> you're small and you're small and kind of kind, but when it comes to fighting, you're ferocious. I wonder what I am. Drew Barrymore. What? I'm sorry to say this, but I just thought of this of you. You're the Wallace. <laughs> because is that because I? No, if because I, I know just, I'm the biggest one on the show. Just because you just laid back and everything, yeah. and I didn't want to say anything about your teeth, but their their canines are kind of long. <laughs> So. Did you know I'm a vampire? So this evening, we have an interview from the movie Spectres. It's a lesser known independent movie with lesser known actors, but we've seen it, and it has a pretty ideal plot with unprecedented values. Don't you think? Mm -hmm. Wait, I might have got that mixed up. Unprecedented plot with ideal values. Those are big words. You'll catch on. Okay. But before we get to the interview, Let's talk video games. Video games! Yeah. Alright! So here we got Super Mario Brothers 3 for the Super Nintendo. And we got Sega Genesis Sonic the Hedgehog. My favorite. Not for resale. Aren't these awesome new games? Yeah, for lived in 1988. Or 1991. Yeah! Well, let me get serious for just one second. Sometimes the potholes and turns in one life is something you don't see coming either. Yeah, if life throws you grenades, from right back at yeah. Counterattack! Counterattack! Yeah! Woo! And if you can't fix something, the directions are probably upside down. Unless you're working on a desk jet printer. Uh, nightmare from hell to copy stationary in a machine. Stationary in a machine. Yeah! But if you're living life to the max, try Boy Scouts. Audition for a play. Upgrade to Gillette. Read a stellar book. Uh, video game. Or make balloons at a birthday party. But don't become a clown. 
or a bank teller opening an account for a clown. Preposterous! Preposterous! Ah. Hey, let's say that again. Preposterous! Moment. It was, and in a non-sexual way. Very non-sexual. Yeah. Back to the interview. We, her name, I think, is Madeline Mead. Nice. And she's from here in the projects. Nice. She was originally born in Scott's Bluff. Texas, yeah! Texas, yeah, do not Woo! mess with Texas. In the movie, she's known as Crystal Stevens, and she has a secret, like, secret identity, like, almost like 007. Ooh, Only this has, like, movie. Only this sword has like swords and stuff like that. <gasps> Even better! She has abilities like teleportation <gasps> where she can disappear. Oh! Invisibility. Oh! Where I'm are you? so hoping to see that stuff. Maybe she'll Me take Me too! I'm totally stoked. That yeah. was so choice, man. Maybe we'll so get to choice. see some of that. I hope! I Woo! hope I can hope! So, before we bring her in... Apparently there are two actors in this movie that look like us, but we don't see a resemblance, do we? Not at all. <laughs> Who would ever want to look like us? But here is a brief preview. Ghostman. He arrives when he pleases. A lot of respectors. We've all prepared for this for a very long time. My blade will taste it. The hunter blindsided you. I was distracted, okay? No, it's not okay. We have to get that key back. We'll scout tonight and see what they're up to. We're actually interested in what the demon hunters are protecting. You mean Crystal, the Emperor's daughter? Or as we know her, the Invisible Child? I was so close! The reason why the Spectres have come here is because they are after Crystal. You are the daughter of the Emperor of the Demon Hunters. You used to be a teleporter within the Demon Hunters, but your memory was erased because the Spectres were trying to assassinate you. <laughs> your wave punches and your telekinesis are better and stronger than any other Demon Hunter. Crystal! Another ability that, that you have is you can become invisible, which is very rare for teleporters. You are also a teleporter. Whoa! Where did this thing come from? I was gonna go over to your house and apologize for accusing you! It doesn't matter now, Caitlin. I'm a changed person, but I do deserve to kill you both right now. Welcome to the Odyssey. Wow, I forgot how low budget that movie was. Yeah, but she had an unprecedented and reliable talent in it. Very true, very reliable. All right, let's bring her in. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. We gotta make her come in. Oh yeah, that's right. We gotta make her. I'll move over that way. She can come here. All right, cool. All right. Yeah. 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 Come from? How did you, How get did you here? do that? What the crap? Thought there were special effects for Spectres. Guys! What? You always say on your show there is no special effects. Yeah? Yeah? Well, there's no special effects. No special effects! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Well, that yeah! is unprecedented. That is idea. awesome! And then, holy! Non sexual way! Non sexual way! Yeah! So, like, well, you don't necessarily yeah. have to right now. So, like, all that stuff in the movies, like the teleportation and the wave pushes, that was really like, yeah. happened. That's real. Yeah. 